So we're at plus three. We do Rage Fist. It hits. It one shots Miss Magius. Real simple. The spooky time event is officially live in Pokemon Scarlet and Violet. And while there is a lot of content available right now, the big prize is the new five star Ghost Terra Miss Magius raid that runs from now until Halloween night. This raid is super easy to do and gives the most amount of candies I have ever seen from a five star raid. And I'm not just talking rare candies, I mean XP candies as well. So today, let's take a look at the only build you're gonna need to take down this raid and hopefully max out your candies before the end of the weekend. Oh yeah, and it's of course Annihilate. That's right, the king's back, so let's take a look at exactly how to build this guy. And there he is, ladies and gentlemen, the king is back to dominate yet another raid. Again, this is Annihilate, it's fighting in ghost type, and for this one, we made this level 100. Why? Because we can. It doesn't really need to be, but you know what? It's better safe than sorry. The held item on this one isn't really important, but if you want to make this as easy as possible, give it weakness policy. Miss Magius knows Psychic, which is going to activate weakness policy, and give you an immediate plus two to your physical attack, which isn't going to make a huge bit of difference, but it's still worth having. For EVs on this guy, there's about a million different ways you can go on this. The important thing here is to make sure that your Annihilate has max physical attack and either max HP or max special defense on this one. Ideally, you'd want to give your Annihilate an adamant nature, so it's plus physical attack and minus special attack, but even if you don't, it's still going to do just fine. The ability on this one is really where things start to become important. Defiant is our ability here, and we really have to have this in order to make this work out perfectly. And that's very simply because Defiant's going to make this so that whenever Miss Magius drops our stats, which 90% of its moves do, we're going to immediately get a plus two buff to our physical attack. So if you come into the raid and Miss Magius immediately uses Icy Wind on you and drops your speed, your attack is already at plus two after one turn, and you're getting a boost to Rage Fist as well. It's gonna make this incredibly easy and make this raid go by super, super fast. As far as the moveset goes for this one, you really only need two moves here, uh, and that is Rage Fist and Bulk Up. Uh, bulk Up, we're gonna use for the first couple turns, that way we can boost our physical attack a little bit more and give Miss Magius a chance to either activate weakness policy or Defiance, and then Rage Fist, of course, is base 50 power, but every time we get hit, it just becomes even stronger. So after two turns of either Bulk Up or a Weakness Policy or some sort of stat-dropping move that activates Defiance, Rage Fist is going to have enough power to one-shot Miss Magius. And as far as the other two moves go on this one, you really don't need to have anything here. You can leave whatever you have there already. But just make sure that you have Bulk Up and Rage Fist, and you're honestly good to go. But, you know what? Don't take my word for it. Let's see what this looks like against Miss Magius. Alright, so for anybody that's just joining in, alright, if anybody, uh, if there's nobody that has seen this yet, alright, here is exactly how you're going to take down Miss Magius and get yourself just the stupidest amount of candies you can possibly get from this, alright? So pay attention, because we're only doing this once, alright? You're gonna start off. Miss Magius is gonna do Astonish. Odds are she's not gonna do it on you. Yep, see, that one's going to Haxorus. Doesn't matter. We don't care about it. First turn, bulk up. Just like so. Physical attack up, physical defense up. Physical defense doesn't really matter. Okay? Miss Magius is gonna do the thing. It's gonna do Psychic on us. This is why you have Weakness Policy. Weakness Policy is going to activate. You're immediately going to get an attack boost. Okay, um, yeah, that's that's perfect, all right? That's what we want. You check where you're at right now. Boom, you're immediately at plus three. You go ahead, you do bulk up one more time because you know what, why not? We got time, it's not like Miss Maggie's is going anywhere. Uh, Miss Maggie's is gonna do Shadow Ball. Odds are you're probably gonna end up with Icy Wind or Scary Face at some point during this. That's gonna activate Defiance. Uh, and Defiant is going to uh, not only boost your attack, but it's going to give you a, another stage up for your Rage Fist. So we're at plus three. We do Rage Fist. It hits. It one-shots Miss Magius. 
Real simple. Annihilate, odds are you have this one built already. Uh, EVs on this one really don't matter too much except max physical attack. I'd honestly do max physical attack, max special defense, just because that way you're going to tank stuff a lot better. But that's it. That's Miss Magius. Okay. But there you have it, ladies and gentlemen. That's how you're going to use Annihilate to destroy yet another raid. Miss Magius raids are honestly kind of nuts and drop just the most amount of rare candies and XP candies that I have ever seen a single raid drop. So I would highly suggest that if you have some free time this weekend, go out and do 10 or 15 of these and you will get yourself plenty of candies to hold you over. I don't foresee us getting this raid again for quite a while, so stock up while you can. But just remember, you guys got this, I believe in you, and as always, thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Later.